Welcome to Tuesday's Tips from So Very Easy. My name is Laura and I love the look of these fancy little towels in a bathroom when guests come over. But there are a couple of things I don't like about them. Number one, I find they're just a little bit too small and number two, well, I really don't like the price. So let's take our own hand towels and fancy them up a little bit. Well, the first thing we're going to need are some hand towels. And I do like the ones that are a little bit larger. And I wash them. If you're using old ones, you won't need to worry about it. But if you have brand new ones, be sure to wash them at least once and throw them in a dryer. They are made of cotton, so they will shrink a little. And you don't want them to shrink after you've embellished them. The next thing you're going to need is the measurement. And I like to decorate only one side, and of course, it's on the short side, so when it hangs over a towel rod, it looks nice. The next thing we're going to need is some embellishments. Now, I keep all of my little odds and sods from projects that I've done previously, and I just keep them so if ever I need them, and this is a good chance to use them. The towels are not very big, so you might have a couple of pieces already in your stash. And there are so many things that you can use to fancy your towels with. I have a lot of this little braid, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to stitch it on, but I'm not going to stitch it directly across. I'm going to put it in a little bit of a serpentine or a curved shape. So I'm just going to set up my machine with matching thread to the trim and I'm going to put white in the bobbin and I'm going to stitch this down in the shape that I want. And before I start stitching I take the ends and I just tuck them in underneath. And the other thing is make sure your trim has been washed and dried the same as you would do your towel. A lot of trims are made with cotton and they will also shrink. So now that's one trim. It looks much better already. What about doubling up on trims? When you double up on them, you can turn something like this into something like this. Here is a pre-gathered ribbon with some white ribbon and this equals that. There's nothing saying you cannot add anything on the end. You could add these great little cotton baubles and then maybe add another trim. And this equals this. I also found in my stash one leftover lace applique and I stitched it on. It's good to have fabrics and embellishments that are soft and of fabric so that it's not hard on your face or your hands. However, sometimes you just need to break that rule. And I have a girlfriend that has this thing about buttons. So I am going to add some buttons and this is going to be the hand towel I put out when she comes over. So from four very inexpensive plain white towels I now have four beautiful designer looking hand towels and it was a fraction of the cost. Now this was done on very large hand towels but there's nothing saying you can't use the smaller ones or maybe you'd like to use the big towels. If you have an area to display some beautiful embellished towels well you can do it at a fraction of the cost. Thank you for joining me today on Tuesday's Tips from So Very Easy. Feel free to subscribe and as always, come on back. Let's see what we're sewing next time in the sewing room. Bye for now.